New Mexico, with a population that exceeds 2 million people, this, according to the 2010 census, lacks something that many other states have, a professional sports team. And sure, while we might have the isotopes and the Lobos to cheer on, we still haven't achieved the next level. I consider UNM New Mexico's team, and I think a lot of fans do. Now, is it because the leagues hate our state that they'd rather avoid it? Do organizations like the NFL or NBA consider us that one place in between Texas and Arizona? Well, it turns out that the reason goes further than that. We'll take the NFL, for example. The league has in place many rules for cities to be able to host a local team. Some of these stipulations include a large population, a large stadium with at least 50,000 seats, and of course, having a large following. But the most important factor for leagues like the NFL is income. You see, they want to make sure that fans living in that area can afford going to the games, so they take into account how much a fan makes. Here in our state, we're not eligible for an NFL, NBA, or MLB team because the average personal income in our state is around $37,000. This according to the U.S. Department of Commerce. Although it's not all bad news, New Mexico is eligible for one league, and that's the MLS. By 2024 is to make a bid for MLS. Larry Espinosa is the general manager for Albuquerque Sol a semi-professional soccer team that was founded in 2014. And as of now, they're New Mexico's biggest hope to get into the national sports picture.